Halloween season is right around the corner and with that said I found a Terraria mod that fits the spooky vibe perfectly. This dope mod literally titled the spooky mod adds in a bunch of new biomes, really cool boss fights, and insanely fun and unique weapons. Make sure you guys stay tuned throughout the video to see all these bosses and weapons. With that said let's go ahead hop into the game and check out the mod. Music is bumping too, there's no reason for the music to be bumping like this. Dance, dance, which one looks like a dancing emote? This one. Who was in the studio? Ah, hell not GR in New Hampshire. Typical day in New Hampshire. What is this? We got a nice little house right here. Sleeping Skull. Oh, he getting jiggy with it. You've been here, you can call me Little Bone. What's up, Little Bone? So reveal the map. So we got a nice little spooky biome right here. The biome looks cool. Music is bumping. You get an A plus from all that. Spooky bat. Little enemies popping up. Damn. They were killing this in the studio. Let's see the pump action leaf blower. Okay. It's, it's blowing leaves. Like actual leaves be falling out. That's kind of cool. Toilet paper. Oh yeah, we got to TP somebody's house. Necromancy for dummies. Conjures various zombie parts that bounce everywhere. Now that sounds cool. Bouncing zombie parts around everywhere. Pretty sick so far. Uh, summons a magical bag of candy to float above you. The candy bag will drop pieces of candy every 25 seconds. Picking up candies will provide different summoner benefits. Yo. Summoner benefits raining on me? No, I love to see the summoner stuff. A hey, little bone gone crazy in here. Maybe he's the one that made the music. Look at him. All right, so what else is there to this mod? Let's see. So this seems like, oh, there actually is some bosses. Cool, cool. There's some armor, obviously building blocks and weapons. <laughs> now that's, that's cool as hell. The creativity off the charts. So look, literally headless horseman armor set. So bonus, your own head will now fight for you. This is like a Isaac item. <laughs> Binding of Isaac ass item. Get him. Using my own head to fight. There's a hell buy him? Oh, there is. I didn't even look at this. <laughs> cool. It looks really cool. Very cool. All the sprites are like, honestly, like amazing. Pull up on him with a leaf blower. Leaf blower playthrough? Hold up. Next playthrough, leaf blower only. All right, we'll check out the remaining stuff after we take a quick little visit. Now, this looks sick. Is that a finger? This looks sick. The music is also bumping down here. I like the trees. Let me cut them down. What do we get? Living flesh? I do like this biome. There's fingers everywhere. So watch where you back up into. Is that a nose? It says use a cotton swab. Hold up. Who got the cotton swab? Got a big nose here. Particularly large cotton swab. Do not shove it up. Giant noses are the consequence. Bro, I do what the hell I want. Oh, damn. Nose boss? Me versus the nose boss. Cool idea to spawn a boss. <laughs> Picking a nose with a cotton swab. Uh, the boss itself looks pretty cool. It's a pretty tiny boss. But uh, I'm liking the attack so far. I like the animation, how his eyes like pop out. I like that it literally is a nose boss. Do some damage to it. Phase two? Man, goofy ass attack. <laughs> the boy was charging up. Okay, gets a little faster, as expected. What my boy drop? superior snot ball oh it's a flail this is such a cool concept for a flail the creative ideas from this team was flowing good job whoever made the mod i'm gonna pick the nose again <laughs> man goofy ass is that all he drops or we just got the same drop in our that's how drake be getting mad what is that manhole okay he shoots a lot more snot Looks like he's dashing a little bit more. The boy, a snot machine gun. Damn, have you ever blown your nose before? He don't know what tissue is. He said, the fuck is a Kleenex? <laughs> My boy got the Gatling gun schnoz. All right, what'd he drop? Suspicious looking tissue. Oh, maybe he does know what tissue is. Summons a baby Mako pet. Nice. Strong booger blaster. That boy got the boogie blaster. Oh, yeah. Booger only playthrough. Then we got the jagged snotty schnoz. Speak about schnozzes. 
Getting hit will sometimes release homing boogers around you. The damage of the boogers will scale based on how much damage you took. What does this look like? Do they put like a schnoz? Oh, what? They should put like a fake nose over your character. Hit me. Damn, they hurt. What the heck? <laughs> you need a special substance snot. No, that's not it. <laughs> I thought that's not surely would have been the special substance. Aha! Look at that. Game Raiders, you are so smart. Uh, can be used to corrupt the giant egg. However, the creature inside will be unleashed. Let's get it. Oh my god. Oh! The egg broke. Ew. Oroboro. It seems like it's got like two mouths. We got the one on the front that's like an eye. And you see like there's another one back there. So does it like split in half into two enemies? Oroboro isn't that the snake eating itself or something? Whoa. That's a cool attack right there. I like that. Where the boss at, bro? The boy hiding. Man, if you know. Oh, he heard me talking. He said, if you don't shut your mushroom ass. I want to see it split in half. Oh my god, it's split in half. Game Raiders is a game developer. He knows how things work. So now you got two bosses you got to fight at once. This is sick, though. I like how the fight dynamic changes a lot more with two of them running around you gotta be on your toes so what if i kill one of them let me try my best to kill one of them and see what happens oh he got iframes bro he's shooting so you gotta kill you gotta kill both of them okay it's not like you kill one and then one enrages i like how they give you little like uh warnings when a f attack is coming so it's not like a cheap shot you get like a little time to react so yeah you gotta kill them both the other one will still stay there if you don't kill both of them, which is cool. Very unique. Let's go ahead. Let's take out both of them. Bombada being dead. And the egg is back there if you want to resummon it. Cool. The relic, I can already tell, is cool. Literally, you know, the Ouroboro sign. What's in the treasure bag? I see you. I did it. Keen Staff of the Swarm. So this makes us lose health every time we use it. It's cool. Interesting concept. Uh, and then we got this. Undying Embryo. Upon death, you will be revived back to one health and given Embryotic Revival. Let's put it on and somebody kill me. I have been revived. I am a new man. Put on God Mode again before I die. All right. Rot Gourd. Hey, I, I was about to say, like, I did not jump. Who made me jump? That boy got that king slime booty slam. He got flies around him. That looks really cool. Hey, those flies are special because Mojang couldn't do that. Attacks are cool so far. I like, the, I like fighting a big pumpkin as a boss. <laughs> okay, so he definitely an early game boss because he took crazy damage right there. So now when he booty slam, he's got spikes everywhere. Didn't mean to hit him right there. Who the hell is that? Rock walker. This is a cool fight. This will definitely be a very fun uh, early fight. Oh, he got a phase two. Phase two. Now he flies. Okay, I did not mean to kill him that quickly. It's all good. <laughs> he took a little bit more damage than I thought he would. Uh, rotten heart. Summons a swarm of damaging flies around him. Cool. We can be stinky just like him. Terraria, no bath playthrough. Uh, ruthless scroll of the flies summons flies that linger above you or any nearby target. Can I shoot them like directly at them? Oh, I can't. A little bit more of a hands on type summon weapon, which I always like. Dope mod though. Very cool mod. I like when mods have a theme and they get really creative with the theme. All the sprites, the weapons, the animations, everything looks good. The music is bumping. It's just, it's a great mod. Halloween around the corner too. Ew. <laughs> but a good type of ew. Blends in perfectly type ew. That's a cool projectile up in there. Gun. Chained eyes. Yo, double flail? That's kind of sick. 
so i hope you guys enjoyed me checking out the spooky mod shout out all the developers creative spiders and everything that made it as you can see i did stream this live on twitch so if the format seemed a little weird or the commentary seemed a little off that is why i think i might do more streams like this where i try and find more underrated tutorial mods like this and the homeward journey mod we checked out y'all let me know in the comments if you would mess with that i think it's pretty fun but yeah let's say let's get this to like 2.5k likes we hit that goal you know when halloween gets a little closer i might make a little terraria halloween theme mod pack just to mess around with for like a stream or for a video not a full playthrough or anything because there's definitely a handful of terraria spooky type mods we could find but yes sir hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to hit that sub and like button i'll see y'all next time